smartphone. But more importantly, it's a Bluetooth loudspeaker. And when I say a loudspeaker, I mean loud sound, projected sound, something you could happily listen to at a party. Now, it charges via USB. Like I say, it uses Bluetooth. And it also has a pulsing light on the top. So, you know, it's full of all the fun and frivolities that you would want at Christmas. Noise, lights, and charges via USB. Let's take a look in the box, which I haven't actually done yet. So this is a bit of an unboxing as well. Now, hopefully I can just grab a tab. There we go. Oh, there we go. Right. Let's have a look what we get. So, there's the actual unit itself. Now, I don't think... Let's have a look and see if there's something in the bottom. Ah, there is. A USB cable, always helpful. And a small instruction manual. Like I say, because this charges via USB... Let's just light that down there a little bit and bring a bit of focus in, shall we? Because this charges via USB, it's the kind of thing you can throw in your bag and take with you. It's got a battery in it. Brilliant. It's certainly very solid. It's fairly weighty, I would say. I'll uh, check the exact weight on it in a little bit. But let's just see if we can turn this on, shall we? That's the light. Ah, right, there we go. Right, so, I've got my Nexus 5 here. The brand new Nexus 5. Let's pop it into Bluetooth. And we'll see if we can get that to start syncing. Bearing in mind I haven't read the instructions, I'm just uh, going with it, as it were. Let's see if we can get this going. Just come on, how difficult is a Bluetooth thing these days to make work? Oh, oh wow, that's blindingly bright. Um, right, so you'd think, hold down that for a certain number of seconds. Let's try three. No, and if all else fails, let's resort to actually looking at the manual. Gutted. Well, I say manual, what I actually mean is a piece of paper. But anyway, right, what we got here? Charging it. All right, controls, volume, Bluetooth, pairing light, reset button. Turn up the volume dial to turn it on. Open Bluetooth settings on your music device. Connect to the ion speaker. Oh, right, let's just press it. Oh, if that, we didn't have to press that, must have been a reset button instead. So, ion speaker. Go on, let's, let's turn the lights on, shall we? Ooh. I'm afraid you... Ah, there we go, you can get a, a better sense for it there. That is brilliantly bright. Looks awesome in here. I feel like a 1970s disco. Right, anyway. So we've got this speaker connected. So let's turn this up. And let's throw on some music quickly. Now I obviously have to be careful because of copyright and everything like that. So we'll try for... Uh, we'll just have to see how well this works in practice. So, let's have something that hopefully won't be copyrighted. Let's maybe we can just find a little bit of uh, abstract disco music would be good. Go with that. Let's start the radio. Okay, now this should be playing. Oh, there we go. Oh, and my notifications. So, this is all on... We'll flick through a few of these, just so I'm not breaking copyright. Didn't like me touching it. There you go, and it's sound reactive as well, so... That is so cool. Yeah! But I'm going to go and play around with this a little bit more and I'll be back for a full review in a couple of days time most likely. But I thought you might like to have a first look at uh, what is probably going to be one of the coolest uh, gifts for this Christmas for anyone with a smartphone. The Ion Party Starter. Very, very cool. And how awesome is that LED array on there? Very good.